welcome to Gamer Ability. I'm your host Six Penny, and I'm back with another PGA Tour 2K21 video. In today's video, you're going to see my first two rounds of the Platinum TGC Tours tournament. If you enjoy this gaming video, drop a like before you go and subscribe to the channel if you're new here to stay up to date on all my new videos and live streams. Tune into a live stream every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and Tuesdays and Thursdays at noon. Stay tuned and enjoy. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and head into the King Invitational, this week's TGC Tours Platinum event, going into round one, which is gonna be medium, default wind, normal fairways, we have firm greens, medium fast greens. Those are the conditions. We just played well, so let's try to score low. Thank you for the follow, Mitch. Greatly appreciate that. Welcome on in. Let's go to the tee. Get our nervous jitters out. Hi there, my name is John. Big I'd fan like to TDC community. To Me as event. well, Mitch. Me and as well. We'll Such an incredible community. I love TGC tours. Let's drop this one in the middle of the first fairway. Take it from there. What do you say? Thank you for the good luck, Stark Shaft. Appreciate that. There, now there's no fans on this course. So gonna have to get the nervous shooters out without getting the fans pumped up. All right, let's get the music off and get ready to go. That's right, Dark Shaft. Okay, swing feels ready. Maybe one more practice swing. All right. And you're away. Let's have a good one out there today. That's a blast. It's going to be right up there. Good way to start it off. Definitely made this hole a lot shorter. Second shot here on the first. Ooh, 225. This is, is a three iron to the green. It's going to hit. So 215 would give us 14 yards to the pin on a slope. Rather be sh putting short than far because you'd be putting up a hill versus down the hill. So basically I want to be right on the side. We have a left to right lie angle. Let's account for that. Wind's blowing to the right. Let's account for that as well. I just don't want to be in the bunker to the to the right. I don't mind being in the bunker to the left. More practice swings that first round. Let's do this. A little on the fast side. It should still play well though. A light rough, very chip interval. In the rough, but close to the green. Let's chip this on and start putting. So we're basically hitting into an uphill and then start sliding down the hill there. Oh, didn't that come Fasted close? Fasted it. Still a solid shot. Should still be able to birdie. Like and I just nice posted chip. a video today, Mitch, right, on, on YouTube with my updated clubs and, and my favorite clubs. If you aren't familiar, I do post on video almost every day for anybody in here. And I live stream on YouTube as well. Let's get this birdie and move on. It's not going to break much. Just don't think about these and just got to hit them. Looking pretty good. There we go. We start off with a birdie and song counted. on hole number That's one. Birdie. Chirping birdies in my soul. And we're starting the day under par. I love, love to see this. Okay, the lengthy par. Four. Thank you, Phil Hinn. Appreciate that. So this is one where I have to make the decision on 
basically we're hitting I'm gonna take a just a tad off this driver I don't need to take much but just a tad Ooh. Unfortunately, I think this is beach. I was bound. so afraid of hitting it in the left bunker, which is where I found myself multiple times right, that I on out of this slowed it into the right bunker. bunker. All right, not where you want to be, but it's not like I am known for my fairway percentage. So this is going to go about 156, maybe a little bit shorter. If we go up to the th three iron. This is not going to be an easy shot. Around 180, but if we put full loft, full backspin, I mean, and a little bit of loft, we have a we're into an uphill lie. It's going to be a tough shot. Swings all over the place. Get up. If that shot is hit perfect, we are right at the hole. And we're in the green side rough currently. Let's uh, be careful with that chip. Okay, so this one I'm basically putting full backspin, full loft to get it to check down that hill. Yeah. Didn't want to risk going That's too far. Nice chip. Well done. We'll take our par. And that will do. And currently one under for the day. Alright, we need to get let's keep the momentum going. Got to start out with the first birdie and everybody there's one minute left on the prediction to cast you your gamer coins four. there. If you have any gamer coins. Let's get the birdie I need the birdie generating song on. Here it is. Green leaves. Ooh. <laughs> it doesn't matter though. I aim so much to the right that this shot is going to play nice. Just got to slow down. Slow down, ball. Don't you dare. Ooh. Thank you for listening. Okay, this is about 150. So basically, I'm going to land in into the slope. 146. Let's add 6, 152, 151 would be fine. Downhill lie. Let's go right at it. A little on the slow side. A little on the slow side, we can find it. Get up there. Ah, uh, just if I hit that 101. With that safely on the green. Good luck on this it's one. Still We've a great shot. Feet. Very makeable birdie opportunity here. So it's gonna break from right to left. Let's try to visualize this one. It's going to start to slow, try to check up. I think that's the read. I'm going to stick with it. My gut tells me a little bit more to the left, just a tad. the hole. Ooh, my gut was yeah. right. Just didn't move it enough. On this hole, we've got this left for par. Uh, you can see it now. Look at the... So, see the ending here? So, when we saw it from the other side, it was not breaking like this. So, you can see clearly from here that there's more break there at the end, which is why I missed the putt. Okay, let's see what the next hole has in store Sometimes for it's hard to pick up those reads at the end. He'll stay at minus one after that hole. A little windy. Gotta for get my the birdies going. There. Be careful. So yeah, this was right earlier. I said we had tailwind. 
So basically, I'm going to land this. It can either land in the fairway up here, here and roll down. Arfibald, thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. We are in hole number four now, one under, still plenty of golf left. Let's see, I could either land it, if you honestly land it in the fairway here, you almost roll all the way up to the green, or you can land it right at like 166, 65. I'm gonna go right here in this area. A Little bit of spin. Yeah, that, that, that would have been way too far. See, Tempo's just been off, the, you know, this whole week, and sometimes you have weeks like that last... Be the club. Stop. Could have been if I put a little bit more backspin. Spin. It was a good one. Let's see. That should pop them up. Let's see. Maybe it's at commands. You could go to two under with this putt right here. Huh. I guess it takes you there. <laughs> But I know there's exclamation mark clubs, exclamation mark tutorials, exclamation mark data, YouTube. I've had this putt before, so it... Wow, if we could have hit this a little bit shorter, we basically have a straight in putt. So it's going to kick to the right. Foot lie at the beginning is going to have more of an impact than I think. Putt appears to be online. The game oh, yeah, gave me that one. Stuff. The game gave that to us, everybody, but that still is a birdie song. Whether Sitting the game gives it to us or not. The round. <laughs> Let's go. Caught the edge, Mitch. Let's go. Right on this one. Thank you, ref. Thank you, ref, on that one. That felt nice. Elboy said at the beginning, unlimited one times, and there was one right there. I'm taking a drink of hot tea right now. And we are going to go to blast this drive. I'm glad that wasn't very fast. We would have been over there in the sand. Get a good bounce. Okay, that was a little nerve-wracking. And second shot here on the fifth. Basically, you want to be short here. If, we, if I can land it 135 to... I need to hit it about 140 because of elevation, add a little bit because of the wind. It's actually a full, if I hit a full club, we do have an uphill lie. It's going to take off some. Not bad. Wow, I corrected. Ooh, so I, I was slow on the practice and corrected here. with even more slow. I'm okay Sometimes with that. that happens. This putt is for birdie. Look at this putt, everybody. There's the chat commands there, Arfabald. There they are. I'm going to play two grid lines over. So it's basically, we're going to hit it so hard at the beginning, it's going to start to break 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 and then it's going to get over this hill and start to slow down and really kick at the end so 
So that's our aim. Let me check distance. So let's go. They're a little slower, these greens. Um. I'm going to go right here. Final answer. Sometimes you just got to hit it. Swing plan was off at the beginning. Still misread it, but well, right up by the pin. Short. Setting up here with a four foot putt. Looking good. We'll take our par, All right, move well on done. to the next one. So two under through five. Would like okay, to get at least in here. Two three or four more day. birdies here. This holds a par three. Thank you everybody for tuning in. Great to have everybody here. See 188, it's gonna to be too, too short. I think what I want to do is actually take off some, hit a partial three iron, put a little bit of spin. This is a shot I historically tr struggled, with, but if my tempo doesn't seem right, I'll change. It's not bad. One more practice swing and we'll see. Okay. So with that, I was a little on the fast side. I'm gonna aim a little bit to the right. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, so I was right that it was a little bit on the fast side, so it was smart to compensate to aim a little bit to the right, but I really fasted that one, but at least we're looking at a putt. Yeah, that'll work. Uh, nice approach. He's okay, sitting with a 37 He's footer. A long way from home. Let's see if he can help it get this there. It's a long way from home. And this is like slick ice here. I mean, it's just going to keep going down that hill, even on medium fast greens. Not much movement. I mean, it's breaking a little bit at the beginning. Then a little bit back to the left at the end. I think a half grid line. Yeah, half grid line. Maybe a little bit more than that. Question is, is it going to come back? Ah, it's not going to come back that much. Oh, great distance, too. Ooh, that good was evening, Noble Panda. Thanks for going pretty good starting off. Two under, three five. Um, could be better, but still, we're playing solid golf. But good to have you here, Noble Panda. Thank you, Visual nice One. In for the par on this Almost one. had the read. And after that one, scorecard says two under par. Let's get the birdie generator song on. Where is it here? All right, let's see Green what we can do it's off back. the tee here. It's a long par four. Birdie, birdie, eagle coming up. I love that visual one. One time on all of them. And this is looking to be about 155 yards All right, out. so if I can land it right in this hill, 147, 151, that's a full swing. Smashed. I did, so I, I I went with the driver, Noble Panda, is what I finally figured out, that the driver's the best play. You just got to hit it firm.
be the club, get up there. Solid shot, but you you all know I had the same putt earlier and missed it, so got to correct. This will take you to three under. Thank you, Doc. Yeah, you're working on continuing education, learning. The Doc's always got to be learning, right? So this I missed this earlier because I pushed the putt, so I will be doing a practice swing here. Trying to see if those are actually breaking. I don't think they are. I'm gonna go right edge. It might not even break at all. My gut wants to tell me it might not break at all. No, oh, it's getting there. Let's go. Let's nice go, job. chat. That's the birdie, there. birdie. I'm telling you, what that song. I mean, I don't want to bore you all and play the whole song the whole night, but there's just something about that song in my tempo. Chirping birdies in my soul. This one's a Third birdie of the four. night. Dark Snowda. Thank you so much for the good luck. How have your rounds been going? I think I can go for this this time with this wind. It's much easier to splash it from there. It's a much easier distance. We talk about being in the right position on the second shot. Thank you, Noble Panda. This one looks pretty Tattooed good. Tattooed that fairway. thing. Stop. Don't go in the bunker. Or the rough. <laughs> hey, I honestly thought John, it was going to be in the fairway, but I did too. None of the deep stuff now. I did too, John. Oh, you made the cut. Nice, Dark Snowda. Let's go. And that is not an easy thing to do. So it's really going to look at this lie angle. It's going to push off to the right. We're going to be coming out of the rough, so it's already going to not spin very much. Chef taking orders. <laughs> Good evening. How are you doing, Chef? I have some hot tea right now. Some cookies would be nice. <laughs> oh, hot tea, even. <laughs> El Boy already redeemed the hot tea, so that's what I have right now. These are unpredictable, these lie angles on the splash. Let's see what my averages are. Splash, red, 5 to 15. But is this is more... So I'm going to go a little bit more because it's more like an extreme red. Yeah. Okay. So that's a lesson to where if, you, if your tempo's off, fast tempo, you see how it basically takes out Here we go. This the lie angle change because it, it immediately takes off in the direction of the tempo. So you're basically eliminating the lie angle. So I was needed a perfect there. Also, oh, Chef, the second rounds didn't do good. Hey, it happens to all of us. I mean, I've been struggling as of lately, so trying to get back on track tonight. So it looks flat where we're starting. Starts to break at the end. Got to hit this. Mm. 
Yes, the game the game is on my side tonight, everybody. All the edge ones are going in. Chirping birdies in my soul. Whoa. <laughs> I didn't see that coming either, Mitch. It just kept... Because it, it was going so fast, too. Here we go. Sometimes five, the game, sometimes the ref is on your side. The ref goes in, you know, just kind of kicks the ball in. <laughs> okay, we got to put on... So there's the birdie song, everybody. Chirping birdies in my soul. But we got to put on Green Leaves back. This relaxing birdie song so I don't smack it. Mmm... Okay, this is my nemesis hole, everybody. This is it. So when you face your nemesis hole, what do you do? You just aim right at the nemesis and smack it as hard as you can into the fairway. Like that. <laughs> or into the bunker. That's a little too fast. That's a little too much anger. Let's take some anger out. That's it. Oh no. That hook was so bad at the end. That wind helped us. But did you all see that swing plane? It literally... Swing. That swing plane literally yeah, hooked backwards yards away. at the end. <laughs> in real life, we are in the water. We're probably across the water to the right. 50 yards maybe oh okay but it's okay that's why we that's why i play virtual golf and not in real life golf right now okay 215 the wind's gonna take us to here but if we can land it in this area downhill lie is gonna add a little bit i'm gonna go for the fairway over here and bounce it down onto the green I'm not gonna lie, in that shot, I stopped breathing. Heading not one. every day you see a swing plane like that drive. That's actually a great shot. Okay, third shot. Perfect splash, splash position, because it's downhill. I don't want to risk hitting this I don't want to hit risk chipping this. I have a better shot to actually chip this one in, but it's a risky shot. Slowed it, but still, it's going to play nice. It's going to take some distance off. That this is a tap-in birdie. Three foot putt. Back into That's another birdie, birdie song. Today. What did, every time we play that song tonight, Five Chip Inable. That's right, moment. Noble Panda. We've had a birdie every time that song's played. But birdie song's back. Let's keep this going. And here we have a lovely par four hole. Five under through ten. Plenty of golf left. Okay, let's see what the caddy book tells us here. Because really this is going to land about 300 most likely through the air that put us right here if we lay up we'll have way too far to go I mean 210 to the flag basically I want to blast this but this is a narrow margin is this even worth it it's a narrow margin it looks like it's sculpted there to the right thank you chef appreciate that let's keep it going my, so here's my thinking. Do I hit, aim at the bunker, smack it into the fairway here, or do I lay up in this area and have a long shot? I think the odds of missing the fairway are equal, so go for it. Likely going to miss the fairway. It likely or equal opportunity to miss the fairway. This is a hard shot to get right with the sculpting here. It's going to sculpt off the fairway. I think this is the play dangerous either way Ooh, that's actually perfect P 
be the club. Come on, Scott. Nah, it's probably going to bounce into the... Well? What a drive. Let's go, Chad. That's a big drive. Good little shot there. All right, second shot on the 10th. Okay, so this one I need to land. I, you can either take two routes. You could go to land it far to have a downhill putt. Hmm. I might try to shape it from here. Hit 145, roll it. It's going to roll and make its way up here and roll towards the hole. Thank you, Z-Man. Hope you're doing well. Thank you, Noble Panda. Forty-six. I, Forty-two should be enough. I really think forty-two is going to carry. It's a downhill line. We'll do a little bit of D-loft. Z-Man with the tier one gifted sub to Noble Panda. Thank you so much, Z-Man. Welcome on in, Noble Panda. Noble Panda is a big. Has been around a long time, supporting on YouTube. It's so great to have them over here on Twitch. Thank you so much for that gifted sub, Z-Man. Let's go. Will The question is, will this get there? That's my only fear. Let's go right at it. Get in. I need that to hit the pin so bad. If that hits the pin, approach. Nice. we're right next to it. Now okay, we're left with a tough downhill feet. putt. Good shot, though. If I put a little bit more backspin on that. Let's see. Can sit a steady break down this hill. It's going to break too much as it slows down if I hit the speed right. I'm hitting this so soft. We're going to it's going to need to break a mile. Looking really good. Still still needed more. One time. That was a good choice. That was a good, perfect time for the one time, Noble Panda. Okay, moving Would have been on. a big one, big one, but we'll take our par. John says, take your par, move on. And you'll stay right there at five under after that one. Five under. Let's let's keep this up. Let's see what we can do here on the eleventh. One seventy. It's going to land like 169. The wind's going to add about 5. It's 175 up this slope. I still think that's better than going over the green. I think this is the shot. Maybe even a slight fast. Thank you, Noble Panda. Great swing. That's it. That's it. Oh no. Red fasted. Get a lucky bounce. Hold. May be able to chip this one in. This is very chippinable. That's going to miss the green. Unfortunate. That is unfortunate, Second John. Shot here on the 11th. Going right for it. Get in. For Let's go. The birdie. game gave us another nice one, everybody. It's like a magnet. That, and let's take one we more are making look at that. all the edge shots. Let's go. Thank you, Z-Man. That is a birdie chip in, everybody. Not an easy one. The 100-bit cheer by Z-Man. Thank you so much for the 100 bits. Yes, so I yes, I'm gonna get a for the round. chip in emote. There's other emotes that'll be coming here in the future. Thank you, Mongoose. Let's go.
That was big. Hole number 12, coming at you. And then now we need to go straight into Green Leaves, our birdie generator song. Let's keep generating them. You can blast this ball if you hit it right. What a drive. That's a beauty. And for everybody that's watching well this done. video on another date yeah, on YouTube, if you're enjoying, the, enjoying this video, go ahead away. and drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new here to stay up to date on all my new videos. It's been a fun round already. Let's keep this up. One sixteen. The reason I like this because if I can slope it down this side, it almost even with the pitching wedge, a little bit of D loft will roll all the way down. I've hit this shot very similar in practice and almost landed it right next to the hole. It's got to be perfect though. Slow would kill this shot. That's the one. And then, yep, yeah, it's going to bounce. Should trickle down. Keep going. Oh, it needed just a little nice bit more. Shot into this I should have put a little bit work. of D loft. All right, let's get a birdie. Okay, is this here, breaking? I don't think it is at the beginning. Because it looks, if you're looking from this position, it looks like the feet are level with the ball. It's hard to tell. Thank you, Noble Panda. But let's find out when it starts to break. It might breathe a little bit right to left at the beginning, because look, this is right to left. Might be a tad right to left. Not, a, I don't think enough to make it miss. Tough read. Got to go left edge though. My, my putting stroke is all over the place. Crushed oh, it. Yeah, I hit it, but it did. If you notice, it came off to the left. It did break Six at the beginning. Go here. Gotta send this one home. This putt's tracking. Who gave it to me it's on the edge? In the hole. We'll take our par. par. We want the birdies, but. And after that one, you're at six under. Missileman, move on. And Look at Kara Cake up there on the here, leaderboard. Got a par three to deal with. She crushed it this week. 199. Yeah, Z man, it was so close. swing was to die for it's going right at it it's got to hit the slope and take distance off okay it took a little bit of distance off but not as much as i wanted it to but we're looking at a birdie putt it'll be all right there Let's see how you do with this 13 foot putt dinner time will you enjoy your dinner griffin Enjoy your night. It, the the uh, VOD will be here on Twitch right after, but also the video will be posted on YouTube 24 hours, sometime 24 hours later. Underground Sports, welcome in to Gamer Get Ability. Thank you for the follow. Five, 10, 12. 
It's gonna break more than I think. And anybody new here that doesn't know me on YouTube, be sure to head over there to the YouTube channel, check it out. At Stream Elements did it right as I was about to do it. Wow, Stream Elements knows me. See, it's kicking to the left right at the beginning. It's gonna kick and it's gonna keep kicking. Is that gonna clip on? I'd rather miss high side than low side. Always rather miss high side than low side. Wow, and we really five. missed it high side. <laughs> All right, here's a five foot putt. Okay. This one's tracking. Finish with our par. All right, well done. Five holes left. We're at six and under. I'll keep you at six under for the round. Five more birdie opportunities. Maybe even an eagle in there. Looks like we're ready to go here on the 14th. Stay in the fairway. Yeah, drives looking. You make this hole here. so much easier. If you, it's not going to catch, is it? Stay in the light rough at least. Oh, we just made well, this hole tough. Kind of land at one point in the fairway. So yes, you're right, Chef. I'm the most bizarre albatross you will see. <laughs> that was insane. Still the best shot I ever hit. That's what happens when you when you fast it there. Well, it's too bad. That's too bad. This is our third shot. And five strokes off the Gotta lead. plant this one close. 82 times 0.89. It's gonna be about 72. It's perfect club down the hill. Uphill line. I actually, yeah, I like this club a lot. Not with the fast, though. Come on. You got this, six penny. Slow. So we definitely got the lower end of the, the lie percentage nice. there. You could get down to seven under par. There goes the goes eagle, in. but we still got a birdie chance. You know, when you're used to the fast greens, to get used to the medium fast, there's a big difference. Looking super. Oof, right Did you on. notice that little correction at the end, back inside? This it would have made, feet. we would have been in. going take our par and move on nice I always done. hate to par par fives but they're gonna happen so we still have another par five yeah, left number 16 six under. good luck par three I think this is the toughest hole on the course club lengthwise it takes a partial three wood basically The wind, actually, I, I like the way the wind's blowing on this hole. Leaves, welcome all, welcome on in. How are you doing this evening? Be the club, come on. Bounce down the hill. Slow, we need to slow down. Great partial wood there. I'll take that. Oh, you're used to medium mist, but then you played the Dirty Ankle Mafia. And they are slow. Are they really? See, I haven't played that. I'll be playing that later on this week. Really need this birdie. C 
see the line. I think that's gonna. I think that's gonna miss high side. Nice work. Yes, Number all we do is Number have to touch seven, the edge, okay. everybody. The games give, gave us every one of those tonight. Seven under for the round. Back to the birdie song. Chirping birdies in my soul. Let's go. Oh, thank you. That would that hole in one was insane. Best but thank you so much for that. Five. Yes, it was a tough loss. I really wanted it, but Slicko Rick came out crushing it. Much deserved win. Those chip ins and that chip in finished a tie and then wins with that difficult birdie putt down the hill never you know it's never fun to lose but uh, it was still a, a very fun night can't believe i got an ace that's like one of my dreams come true an ace in a match play that video will be for anybody that missed that match it'll be going on youtube tomorrow thank you noble panda thank you z-man you caught it noble panda with the one time there okay let's get the Let's get the birdie song. Let's get the birdie generator on. The birdie generator. Where is it? Green leaves. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that makes it. Yeah, and the different consoles makes a difference. You can't play together, but. If only they can add crossplay in the next game, I'd be so happy. We all would. Come on, bound. I have to find the fairway on this hole. Hold ball. Don't you do it. It's going to roll in the light rough. Still, at least it's not in the heavy rough. Turns out we ended up in the rough. So, uh, yeah, my bad. Sorry. John. And here's our second shot on the 16th. Oh, this is a great club. In the rough, up the hill. I think this is going to get there. Don't have to worry about the lie angle because I'm going to crush this ball. Can't place my finger on it. Ooh, Something was off. That's that going to take though. all the distance off of it. Very fast at it. Oh boy. Okay. That's what happens when you're just trying to crush it. Sometimes you do that. Yes, crossplay would be this great. Is third shot. And four strokes back at this point. This is my least favorite range, everybody. so hard to get that tempo right i fasted it. it it's so hard for me to get that splash Andrew tempo right shot Andrew, four strokes away because if you lead. don't put shot shaping on it it's just gonna roll for days this is very chip inable though Let's go, Chad. That song that has worked 90% of the time tonight. That is another birdie. What does the chat think? Should we play it again? <laughs> After the birdie song. There are chirping birdies in my soul. Chip Inable, Noble Panda called it. Let's go. And you're eight under par currently. Eight under. Okay, we got a bit of a long par four here. Let's see how this tee shot shapes up. Oh, this one's in the fairway. Thank you, Noble Panda. Thank you, Chef. Class is in session. I know I never putt from the fringe, Z Man. I love so. the chip. Andrew, three strokes off the lead. There's Luca coming in here. I don't know if you can hear him meowing. We'll put his. We'll put him up on the screen for a second. <laughs> All right.
Let's get a little bit of music back on. I, let's not put green leaves on yet. Let's just do another relaxing one. Slow down the tempo. There's there's the dock with the sneeze. All right, here we go. She just walked in the room. 188. Should be a great club. Into the green right here. It's got to be a perfect. Be the club. Come on, ball. There we go. Oh, it's going to come down, but still, I mean, it's... Oh, it's going to come all the way down. No. Good job. Okay, sink this. Yeah, some people are really good part. at... Yeah, if it's flat, putting from the fringe. Um, I've just always been good at chipping that I usually choose to chip. Look at this. This is a tough putt because it... Basically, I'm just going to go to hit the hole, obviously. Stay on target. Let's do this. I know if only that ball wouldn't have kept rolling down or if we can get it a little bit more there to the left. Crushed it. Oh, come on, oh, get in. You have to hit the hole. Let's go. Oh, man. I crushed that ball. Okay, nine under is current score. In the gray fast. But that is a birdie, everybody. Yes. We got a right to left cross breeze going on this hole. Well tucked pin, it really is. Let's go, everybody. That's a big birdie putt. Birdie with, I call that a. You know, John says birdie with big wings is an eagle. Birdie with semi-big wings right there. Those big birdies. And hopefully this one's nice and safe in the fairway. Thank you, Chef. Let's keep this up. Thank you, Noble Panda. Thank you, Z-Man. Let's keep firing. This is the time, everybody... We're we'll refinished okay, with the birdie, and we're putting green on green here. leaves to generate the birdie. Okay. I am too, Z-Man. So basically, we want to land this on the right side here, funnel it down towards the hole. 161. Got to add about 7. That's 78. I mean, 68. So basically a full 170 with a little bit of stopping action. Significant lie angle and wind. We don't want that. Let's get those slows out of our system. That's I'll take a slight fast, but not a slow. Okay, on, we're gonna to be right in a chip inable position here. My computer just gave me a notification, right, but I'm not sure what the notification okay, was. Here's our third shot, and you're two strokes off the lead. Okay, let's chip this one in, everybody. Finish with a chip in birdie. Yeah, so it narrows up there, Noble Panda. If you go for that, I usually miss the fairway. So I just take a little bit off the driver. I can make this make this one time one time right here everybody slow is not gonna cut it I'm gonna practice swing so much on this one this is such a big shot oh 
Okay, we can save par here Crushed with this Crushed it. All right, let's finish with the par. Don't want to bogey this. So far, so good. Okay, finish with the par. You move on. Finish your round Solid with the first par. round. That's okay. Nine under. That's the best I've scored on this course so far. So, well done. very Nine solid first round. Puts round. us ten. Puts us and with in tenth because there's I so many players you. tied for I second out there, there on the leaderboard. So here we go, everybody. We're moving into round number two. We have default southeast, firm, very firm, fast, tough conditions. The cut line is probably going to be 14 or 15 under. We're sitting at nine under. Let's do this. Kick here we go. Now, I usually Let say get the fans popped up, but there, there are no fans on this course. We'll so let's just get the nervous jitters out off the first tee, get the music off, get mentally prepared. That's the swing. Let's do it. And with that, you have begun. Best of luck to you. It should still end up in the fairway. I was a little worried with that significant fast swing, but yeah, we're still going to be in the fairway. It was tidy. Second shot here on So I first. told myself earlier that I was probably going to hit the driver. I, I don't see the point, though. I really don't. I remember the reason I said was I don't have to be in between clubs. But I don't think a driver... 295... 238... So it's going to land up in this area. It's definitely going to get more roll. I think I'm going to go with the driver. Yes, you're right, it's Narwhal. Get the people in the skyscrapers pumped up. <laughs> this is, I don't know if this is worth it in the uphill lie. Part of me, let's look at the caddy book. Part of me wants to kind of land this somewhere like 8 in the 80 lob wedge range. Like 80, 88, so 193. And then have a wedge into the green. Because I don't think the driver has a chance to get up that hill. Because we have an uphill lie angle right here. So basically, when I hit this, we're only going to use lose like 5 or 10. And then the lie as well, we're going to lose more. So what I'm probably going to do, the other case would be to hit the 188. I think that I'm going to go the driver. Let's do it. This has the highest potential. You must be feeling lucky. Taking driver off the turf. Don't see that every day. I guess you're just going to take that driver off the fairway. and. So it would have got way. there. It would have got there with the right tempo. Playing from the sand, we'll see what okay, type of shot we shot. have. So, 30, we have an uphill lie. It's kind of hard to see the uphill lie so it's going to take 0.78 probably going to get the lower percent 23 down the hill is actually not with the 102 i'm going to do a full shot too risky to go up to a 42 that would be insane gonna go for the 102 fast Try to land it down that hill. I'll take it. That's going to be a birdie putt. Not going to be an easy putt on this green, though. And now we can grab our putter. Setting up here for the 10 foot putt. Gotta send this one home. One time. Tough to pick up this break. So it's going to kick. That What I'm worried about is as the ball slows down at the end. Is it going to come back at the speed? I 
I think so. Final answer. It could be a good one. Oh. Just broke a little too much at the end. Par. Always and hate to par drops. a par five, but we parred that hole in practice as well. Maybe the play is to, to lay up your round, even or just hit a better shot. One. Got a par four on this one. Whew. Should be a good result off the tee here. Lost tempo a little bit. May have to do a few practice holes. I mean, shots. Well, from oh, where you parred it both standing, rounds, that Narwhal. Like a pretty decent shot. Just That's always, you well. know, starting off with the pars. Funnel it down. So 170. I need to add about four. That'd be 174. Wind is almost non-existent. Lie angle is going to take off some. I'm going to go right for this. How did you shoot, Narwhal? I struggled last week, last few weeks. Here we go. Ah, red fast. So see, my tempo is just off on the actual shots. Just got to find it. So that's what amazes me in this nice game, you know, even with green. so many rounds that I put in, next putt and you'll grab tempo that is night and day from this first round to second. Oh, minus 7 through 25, then minus 8 through next 8, minus 15, let's go. Way to bounce back, Narwhal. Yeah, that works. That's, that's a cut made. So this is going to be, it's really going to kick in this middle we have a backstop so we don't have to worry about it going too far dangerous putt I'm hoping to have that finish right now Narwhal calling it in right now let's do it wow look at that green Ooh, solid putt. Ugh. Yeah, I can't really complain about that. Okay, time to finish up. Okay, now let's check the standings. Sitting at nine. Under okay, let's for the end round. this par train. Let's get the birdie train going. The song we, we those of you who are new here, I have two songs: the birdie and song you know, after I get a birdie, long, and the four. birdie generating song. This song, Green Leaves, from Stream Beats just seems to bring the birdies we'll see if that's the case right now though I'm gonna do a practice swing okay that's it okay perfect drive right in the middle of the fairway that was well played and this is somewhere around 155 yards out. So I want to land this exactly what I did earlier. If I can land it here, 149. Need to add about six. That's 155. The wind's going to take off about seven. 60. I'm going to do a full swing, 160. Perfect. Definitely going to do more practice strings right now because I keep fasting it. Okay, that's the one. That's it. Heading for the green. Didn't use any shot shaping there. That was the mistake. Not necessarily a mistake. I, I was going for the 100, not 101. So we picked up a little bit more distance through that. Okay, on the green safely. And from 23 feet away. Okay, 22, seven inches downhill. Fast greens, too. This thing's gonna go. 
all left to right is going to definitely kick as it gets to the end. I'm going to go half a grid. Let's hit this. Go ball. Get in. So close on these putts, just not dropping them right stroke. now. Almost had the birdie. All right, let's see what the scorecard saying. Have to turn it on. Good putt though. And your score is currently nine under par. I mean, if we rewind to the second hole, Teeing almost a made birdie hole. putt. Almost a made birdie putt here. The birdie's gonna fall. So this one, I want to land it. Use the slope right down here. Funnel it all the way down. If I can hit it 175, 176, it's basically a one, a full 170. Should work very nicely. It's gonna have to kick. Keep going, ball. Look at this. Keep going. Don't stop. Oh, that had the line to go. That was yeah, going nice right work. at it. That is a, that's a good little approach shot. Thank you, John. All right. This is for the bird. Maybe a little bit of D-loft on it. It might have went in. These are the these have been the ones that I used to always make, but here recently my swing plane's been off. Let's get this birdie. This one's on a good line. <sighs> swing plane was off again. Just a little bit aggressive there. Here comes a four. Okay, we're gonna find these birdies. And in the hole. Four straight pars. Right Can somebody call on the birdie train? Call on the birdie train right now, everybody. Teeing it up on the fifth. Tweet, tweet. Birdie train, let's go. <laughs> Nicely done. Okay, another fairway. And this one's about 120 okay, well, yards to the pin. Basically, I'm going to land this on this hill, roll it down towards the hole. I could also go to stick it. 112, up four, take some off. I'm going to go to stick this thing. Bounce to the right. Go right at it. Narwhal hears the train coming. I do too. Well done. That's another green and regulation. 10 footer from here. Is this the train? Been missing them, not reading enough break, so I'm gonna go past my instincts just a little bit. Dangerous putt, because look what happens if it goes far. An edge All right, burner. Our putt. Right on the edge. Okay, if I hit that a touch softer. For us. Another par. Maybe the train All is right, running a little bit high. It's going to come score. on the next hole. And hopefully you can stick this this one is close. just like my practice round. So 
I remember what I need to do. 208, land it near this slope. It's going to kick up to the left and roll up towards the hole this way. exactly what I did in the practice round got a nice bounce though this is got to chip this in approach was a bit wayward must chip Let's right here this green side rough cleanly oh, babied it Trying to go oh, for nice little a little bit there. of a fast there. We'll take our par. par. It's a good spot to be on that hole. Par city okay, still. Nine under is the current score. Gonna have to have a huge back nine or and into front. Is upon us. I mean, there's plenty of golf left, but. Well, there's some hook on to this one. State, get in the fairway ball. Hang on. Okay, this is about 155 yards to the pin. So this this is a tough pin location. Bait. I want the down. I want the uphill putt. So I want to be in around this area. 142. At six. 148. Take off about seven because of the wind. So 141. Pretty significant lie angle right there. It's a good swing. 96 power though. It's not going to be enough. Wow, that we would be right at it with a great with a perfect power there. Okay, we're on the green. Ten under if you can sink this. Okay, very makeable. Seven inches up. About 30. It's going to break in the middle. About right here is it's going to start breaking. One time. This is it. Just give me one right here. Let's do a practice swing so I can get my tempo dialed in. Not tempo, swing plan. Get there. Oh, wow. All right. I mean, I'm so close on these putts. The whole time, Next. there hasn't been a putt that I missed by a mile. They've all been so close. Sitting Last round, I was hitting them. The round. This round, I'm not. And now we're. And I tend to play better on fast goal. greens, reading the reading the greens, anyways. Still plenty of golf left. No need to panic. There's still some eagles that can happen. There's still a lot of birdie opportunities. And this one's about 100 yards out. Could pitch it. Could pitch it up that hill. I don't pitch too much in that situation because you can't get it. Yeah, this is the play. 95. It's going to hit about four yards shorter, 91. But I hit usually 101, so I'd push it to about here. And it could hit that slope and roll down. Pretty significant lie angle. The wind's going to blow it back to the left. I've seen these lie angles not have much of an effect. I've seen them have a big effect. Oh, 
be the club. Okay, great position. I believe that gives us an uphill putt. Oh, that'll work. Okay, it does. Yeah, Johnny like. Not an easy one though. All right, let's take this for birdie and peace out. What do you say? Yes, nice that's it, chat. Finally, a birdie song for all the new viewers in here. Yeah, and your score new followers. Ten under Every time I birdie, we play There Are Chirping Birdies In My Soul by Reed Mathis. This course is Silver Teeing Beach. This one up on hole number nine. Silver City Beach Club. Billy, it's a great course. It was a collaboration course between, I know... Reeb Doog and Todd Father, who was in here earlier. I'm not sure, sure who else was involved. Probably a lot of people. Thank you, Narwhal. Great course. Thank you, Furka. Let's keep it going. Let's put on green leaves. Par 5, everybody. The water is in play. Trust me. I've been there before. It's not fun. Looks like this one will be safe in the fairway. Could be. I need to go for eagle here. Thank you, Doc. Okay, hole number nine, shot number two. Let's see what you've got. Okay, this is it. Remember, earlier I said I need to be a little bit closer in the practice round. And now I'm sitting closer... 215 if I can slope it down this hill we don't have to worry about the water because I'm gonna hit a slight fast not that fast that's not bad either that's it Please, Bob, would you consider kicking right? V-Dog, my man. Great to have you here. We are on the second round right now in Platinum. Oh, let's go. V-Dog, that was for you. Nicely Almost an albatross. That is a tap-in eagle. And, under regulation, mind you. and V Dog enters you Just pop this in the with hole. an eagle song, Get everybody. Eagle. Let's go. Good putt. Eagle song and is once one, was by K1. Let's go. All right. V Dog nine, brought that energy. Nine, up on hole number 10. We have so many great content creators in, in here tonight. Every all the content creators know it's still Vike. It's Narwhal. Noble Panda is a content creator over there on YouTube. V Dog. Everybody, check out every check out It's Narwhal. Check out V Dog. So many great content creators. So fun to watch. Thank you for that, V Dog. Alright, let's stop the Eagle song and focus up. That's 12 under. This was the hole designed by Todd Father. That's one of the toughest holes on the course. I'm not gonna hit the shot. I went for this earlier and it did not pan out. I honestly don't know what shot to hit here. Maybe that? Yes, this hole is mean. Whew. Oh, that's, that's a smart shot. Here's our second shot on the 10th. So 215. Oh, here's the play. If I can hit it in this air area, it could kind of hover all the way down, all the way down towards the hole there. Uphill lie is gonna take off some. Gotta be, see that's actually not bad. Perfect would, is what I would want. Swing oh no. didn't feel as clean as I know you can. John here. said it right. Swing did not feel as clean as he knows oh. I can. A new follow, Trent McNeely. Oh, Welcome one, on in. Okay. Great to have you here. This is what our third shot's looking like. 
partial the driver. That's right, V-Dog. I hit a lot of partial drives. Me and you both hit a lot of partial uh, shots. Driver, woods, wedges, irons. So this is a splash shot out of the bunker. This is my... The reason this always is tough for me... A new follow, Billy Kurtz. Welcome on in. Thank you for the follow. 30 uphill four. The lie is going to carry it here, but it's going to roll down. Ah, oh, this is going to be unpredictable, everybody. We need a we need one times right here. Thank you, Narwhal. We need the one times. Whether you have the emote, if you're a subscriber, this this is I need that one time power. There it is. Love it, Still Fike. Love it, Doc. That's just me hoping that it rolls all the way down. Oh, that's the one time right there. Let's go. Wonderfully played sand shot. That's how you do it. If you sink this, you could save power. Love it. Love it, Still Vike. Love it. 480 gamer coins well spent for the one time. Let's go. All right, we'll see you in a little bit there, Narwhal. Let's hit this par. That's a big par. Okay. That that's a whole lot. You, if you get a birdie, it's just, it feels like an eagle. 12 under par after that hole. All right. Let's get a, I need, I feel like I need a song right now. Here comes Green leaves. The, 11th hole. the birdie generator. Okay. Is this another three iron hole? Guess you could technically hit a 102 slight fast up the hill to have an uphill putt, or you could go for the partial three iron and risk having a down. Hmm. Let's see where the tempo's lying right now. If it's on the fast side, I'm gonna go down a club. Wow, is it on the fast side? Okay, yeah, th this is not the shot. Yeah, but that's one. Two? Are you kidding me? Can I? Am I actually? Is this the shot? This you. This is when you'll see me get sweaty with the practice swings. When you see me sitting on a big shot like this. <laughs> I think it's the shot. be the club roll back over to the right that is a great partial three iron oh yeah you'll take those all day all day this one's a 10 foot putt need to send this one in for par i mean par birdie Urge to fly. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on into Gamer Ability. All the new people that jumped in, check out. You'll see me over on YouTube a lot. Create a lot of content on YouTube. Live stream on both YouTube and on Twitch. Gotta hit this. Well, it's heading towards the hole. Let's go. Nice that job. is big. That That's is a birdie, birdie song. That one is for you, Urge to Fly. And after that one, you're sitting at 13 under par. Chirping Birdies in My Soul by Reed Mathis. All right, put this one out in the fairway. Plenty of golf left. Get a good bounce. Not quite the bounce I was looking for. Oops. Sorry about that. My bad. We uh, did John. not end up in the fairway. 
but I can still hit this down this slope. So 113. So if I hit this full 116, 116, that's still 0.9. Could land anywhere from 104 all the way up to about 112, maybe a little bit more. Still, I think it's the club. We have, well, we have an uphill lie angle. With a little bit of D-loft, it might get there. Gotta think, the second shot, I'd rather be short than far. A putt from up here, you risk rolling all the way down off the green. So, definitely would rather miss... One or two actually would be great. Okay, I knew that's just well, better than being above the hole. Today. Very chip interval that's here. Right. A little on the fast side. That's the one. Oh, I gotta hit it. A hundred percent. That's there, in the pure. hole. That's pure. Take our par. Nicely done. We're that's in there a, for the par. That's one I really like to birdie because it's, it's a simple shot. It's you if you hit the fairway, it's a simple shot into the green, and you have an uphill putt with a lot of break in it, but it's. Definitely a birdie hole. Let's see how hole. close we can get this one uh, to the pin. I want to land this. You could either I could either go short, hit it off this fairway, roll it up, and have an uphill putt from here. If I hit 188, the wind's going to take off just a little bit. 170 is going to be too short, so I'm going to do loft and spin with a full 188. Okay, a little on the fast side. And the approach heading to the left. Wow, that came out. I really don't know how, you know, sw swing plane was not well, off. I, can't hit all the I don't know how that ball Okay, from the green side. Behave sand. that way, I really we don't. Get up and down from here. Okay. Yeah, that was kind of bizarre. I'll take it uphill putt for the par. All right, not a whole lot of work left to do here. Nice shot. Looking pretty good. Take our par. That's that's not good one I have on, on my list one. as a must birdie hole. We have five holes 13 left. Thirteen under for the round. Thirteen under for the round. Cut's okay, gonna be at go fourteen or fifteen under. 14. Let's get the birdie generator. Green leaves on. It's a beauty. It's going to hit this slope, bounce right in the middle. This is on my list as a must birdie hole. All right, here's our second shot on the 14th. Noosh, thank you. Appreciate that. Oh, this could be perfect. In the fairway. Full wood, slight fast. It sounded a little bit off. Get a good bounce. Ah, still in splashing distance. This one's your third.
Gotta hit this one close. This is a must birdie hole. Not bad, not great. All right, here's a seven foot putt. Is this gonna break true? This putt's tracking. Ooh, okay. Good work. That's a birdie song, everybody. I was, I was so nervous. I get so nervous on those under putts. The round. 14 under. Can we keep it going? Plenty of golf left. Off Four on holes. Three. I think this is the toughest hole in the course. It plays the toughest for me. All right, birdie song's off. It's time to play some golf. If I can land this around this 133 area, or even here, one, 233, because what it's going to do it's gonna roll up, roll up, and then start to make its way to the left right at the end. That's a good route to take, but it takes a perfect shot. Well, does the perfect. The these are the big ones. Should take a nice bounce, so it's gonna bounce on the green. Come back. That's going, that should go right at it if it keeps going. Good golf shot, it just died. If we can get a little bit more distance, good. you see how that was would have funneled right down to the birdie. hole? Let's hit this birdie and move on. A lot of break at the beginning and end. It all depends on the speed though. If I can, I can play this a little more aggressive and go and take break out of it or I can play it a little bit slower. Because it's gonna cut cut start cutting it's going to really slow down here and my hope is that it's going to grab it's going to really kick at the end only time will tell though and it Ooh, did and that's your fourth that's it everybody another birdie back to back birdie songs it really did it took the line and i said it in slid in right on the edge at the moment 15 under let's keep going lower can we get let's to this one 18 on this par five hole thank you doc love the hemo height there let's go all right Slow it down, calm down the tempo, just put this one in the fairway. Oh, Is that the one? The fairway. Ah, it's staying the light rough. Oh, it's gonna go in the heavy well, stuff. Defense, it did hit the fairway. At least it? it's a par five. Okay, second shot here on the 16th. At least it's a par five. So 215 is either going to carry 0.88, so 189 here, or 167 here. Get a better lie with full loft. But it's going to take off distance. I, I don't usually mess with that. So let's get out our caddy book and see 
Let's give us 90 if we hit it like 162. That might be the better play. Play for the easy wedge up into the green on the flat fairway over here. Play to my strengths. Okay, back on the fairway. Let's set our sights on that green. Okay, here's our third shot. Okay, into an uphill. This could be great. If we can hit this on the slope, 100, up 4, that'd be 104. Wind is basically non-existent. The slow would be detrimental. Don't want that. 88 is going to be so short. Okay, I've lost my swing. That's it. Oh, I thought I was in the actual swing. Okay. That's a beauty. Let's hit this. Good work there. Great shot on the approach. And good luck here. Six feet to go. Looking good. Yes. Nice putt. And that's Let's go. It's another birdie five, song, everybody. Okay. Three birdies in a Down row to finish. Let's keep par. up this clutch finish. T tied. Let's see where. Look at Kara up there. Love Scud. Noosh. Bit of Rocket. a long par four here. Uh. Nothing you Noosh can't crushed it. Sure. So, uh, Way to crush it. Put it in the fairway and take it from there. All right. Let's move on. Put one in the fairway. I'm going to hit another partial drive. Okay. Uh, talk about a red fast right there. <laughs> It's a scary shot to hear when you have the water there to the left. And this is around the uh, 190 mark. Okay. Oh, this is a funnel. We could you put full backspin, land 188. The wind's going to add a little bit, but basically, if I can hit almost full backspin with a touch of loft into this green, this could be perfect. I. I don't want to hit it in the water though, so I, you may see me play this a little safe. Yeah, I'm definitely going to play this one safe. <laughs> we are not flirting with the water. And that's why you play it safe, just in oh, case something like that happens. Too much on this. Oh, we would have been in the water. Okay, ended up nice and okay, safe. we're putting. Still a little work to do, though. A little Careful work? With this one. This is a whole lot of work. Out. 15. I'm going to take 15 times 1.5. 22. So it's breaking up significantly to the left. Then it's going to catch back. And I'm hitting it pretty soft. So in the beginning, we're going to get more break than, than you would expect. 1 time. Slide in. Keep sliding, ball. Oh, oh what a putt. That's, that's tough. All right, nice little two-foot putt. Take our par. All we right. didn't hit the water, the next. even though we were dangerously close. We dodged it. 16 under for the round. One time. There it is, Doc. There it is, Z-Man. Let's keep this up. All right, hole number 18, ready to go. Just got to put this in the fairway. Definitely going to do a partial. It 
it was shots, it was so decent. close so close Would love to finish with the birdie here. Solidify our this cut. Shot is clocking in at 195 yards away. So everybody, my rounds, my TDC tour rounds, will how it'll lie. If so, it'll be on Friday, most likely. It'll depend. I'll see when the killer bees matches are played this week, um, and and try to pick a time to where it's not as best I can to where it's not interfering with those matches. So it could it could be tomorrow. Uh, it could be tomorrow, but most likely it's going to be on Friday. Uh, probably around 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. That's my normal stream times every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and Tuesdays and Thursdays at noon. If you don't see me on Twitch at any of those times, that means I'm over on YouTube. See, 180, I want to hit this. 186. Mm. Definitely want an uphill putt. If I hit this speed right here, it's going to land 182. A four iron, nothing can get up that hill. But if I hit a partial three, we could end up having a crazy downhill putt. I think this is the club. Let's do this, everybody. I'm going to go for a slight fast here just to get a little more power. I'm not going, not going for a red fast or anything like that. Okay. <laughs> my uh, my thumb said, "Oh yes, you are. You're going for a red fast here." <laughs> what a kick! Stop, please. Hold on, ball. Don't you dare. It's gonna do it. It's gonna roll down. That hurts. What's well, unlucky? Missed the green on. We would have had a nice look. And this is our third shot. Now, I could splash this 16 up the hill. I think splash might have a better chance of making it. Unlucky. <laughs> that was. It, it just kept it just kept rolling. I used up all my ref points in the fr Oh! Let's go! Let's, Let's go, chat! What a way to finish! Let's get pumped up. A little... Doc put the Hemo hype earlier, and Stillvike put the Hemo hype there. That is a little taste of Hemo Splash. Love to see it. Yes, the ref. Yeah, take that, ref. <laughs> That is a chirping birdies. Well Let's go. Thank and you, Furka. For that you is so a 17 playing. under par, everybody. Fourth place on the PC. Look, oh, thank you for the hundred, the 200 bit Z-Man. Two cheers. Thank you, Narwhal. Thank you, Z-Man. So that puts us up there. So we have Rocket G always up there. Noosh always up there. Love Scud. Me and then Kara, look at Zakopster. Uh, we're tied with Zakopster. Doc with the 100 bits, get, getting this hype train going after that big round. We missed the cut in two consecutive weeks, everybody. We battled back. I owe that to all of you. Everybody who watched this live, everybody, wa everybody who's watching this not live on YouTube, and to Z Zakopster. Because Zakopster hit us with that raid energy and you all carried me to the finish line. Started off slow. We'll look at the scorecard. Started off slow. Look at this. Par City. But I remember Narwhal and Doc called in the birdie train on hole number five or six. And then it was a little bit late, but called it in and got a birdie eagle. Clutch finish. 14, 15, 16 birdies. And then birdie on the 18th. Put the icing on the cake. That's a cut made, everybody.
Let me pop up TDC Tours here so we can take a look at the leaderboard. Ryan Gamer. 27th position, everybody. 27th. Let's go. So we're sitting at 27th place. We still have two rounds left to play that will most likely be played on Friday. Follow me on Twitter. That's the easiest way to stay up to date on all my matches. But if you're watching this video on YouTube, thank you for watching this video till the end. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and drop a like before you go and hit the subscribe button to stay up to date on all my new live streams and videos. Tune into a live stream every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and Tuesdays and Thursdays at noon. I stream on both Twitch and YouTube. So check Twitch first. If you don't see me over on Twitch, that means I'm over on YouTube.